Uh, what's happening, fam? LA Y'all Movement Still Moving. Book entitled Lessons from a Non Custodial Father, Amazon Kindle Create Space. Fellas, this is where polygamy goes wrong. Some of you, some of you brothers have thought about and talked about polygamy. You know, because the community's already practicing polygamy with all this cheating. I, I, I could have swore I made a video about this already, but fuck it. But the community, for the most part, is practicing dirty macking, not polygamy. But for some, for for the small number of guys who are practicing polygamy for real, you know, women are like, you know, we work as a team, we're a unit. He has, we, it's us two wives or three girlfriends or four wives or whatever. And we, we are a team. We all work. We all have responsibilities. Teamwork is a great thing. I ain't going to get mad at you with that. But this is where polygamy goes wrong. See, a lot of you fellas out here will love a polygamous relationship, right? I don't know if it's polygamous. I think polyamorous is the girl. But here's the problem. So, how, first of all, how the families of your girlfriends or wives feeling about this? One, because you damn sure ain't everybody, what kind of Thanksgiving, you gonna have to have Thanksgiving dinner at, and Christmas dinner at your damn house, because you're not about to take two, three, four girls, four women to all of their family houses as and like, hey, this is, hey, we brought the wives and the kids. Yay, we're going to eat like we a family. Other people going to sit there. Because everybody and every family, whether it's fathers or mothers, know. They don't, they want their, their daughter to be the, the number one woman. The wife, the only woman. Not one of four, one of three, one of two, number two out of three. You know what I'm saying? Number three out of four. Like, mmm. That's not gonna. That's not gonna work, B. Uh, and you can say, you know, we grown, we do our thing. You're right. We making these decisions. That's cool. Uh, the other thing about that is this presentation, because a lot of the guys that that that, that are doing this polygamy, y'all some dusty looking motherfuckers. Like y'all look like y'all full of shit, and y'all don't do nothing with y'all selves. And these women out here working and doing all the goddamn work. Y'all looking like dusty pimps trying to get over. I'm just going to call a spade a spade. So, uh, you, you're trying to say you out here doing work. It just doesn't look like that. But we're going to get into the deeper problem. you hypocrites. See, whether you're the man or the woman in this situation, you don't want your kids to do this. See, if, you, if you're a guy, you got a daughter, and I want a polygamous relationship, you don't want your daughter to be one of, you know, number two out of three, number one out of four, you know, the the, the main chick out of two women in the marriage or the, or the second chick in the marriage, you know, you don't want that. that it, it's not cool no more. All right. No, player, my, 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 my child is not going to be like that. And if you were, you know, a mother, a mother of that was in a polygamous relationship, and you have a son, and he, and he starts to have, uh, decide that this is a norm for him. You're going to look at it like, I don't want my child taking care of irresponsible women or being dumb enough to get played by a group of women you know what I'm saying not saying that you know it, it wouldn't happen I mean I'm trying to use the positive and negative but I'm using extremes on the back end right cuz you like cuz women know women's intentions so it's like you know uh, they don't want to put their son in a predicament where he has to ultimately because as a man you're gonna be look at the figure that's supposed to take care of the family so a lot of the um polygamy talk uh still falls on the society where you know you it's not really wives it's concubines but what ends up happening is you got these guys 
who people are going to look at, he's the head of the family. I don't care how many girl, women or wives or concubines or girlfriends, however the hell he want to call it, uh, he need to bring home the bacon. He need to take care of these women. He need to satisfy these women and their children. And plus, we live in a society that uh, the children might not be his, all of the children might not be his own. She she might be coming with kids, so some people might be taking care of their kids and other people's kids, and, and you know what I'm saying. And which let's get into this that causes another problem because. If you have ch a child or children with somebody and then they move on and they talk to somebody else and then you're in a polygamous relationship and your kids around this polygamous relationship because y'all as adults decided to do this, the, the parent of them other kids, oh, they're going to have a problem with that. They're going to have a serious fucking problem with that. Because it, in some ways, it's fucking up the kids, you know? <laughs> and just an idea, just an ideals and ideology, like you know, you know, oh, how, what are y'all doing? Well, since Mama's the third wife, you know, the second wife actually teaches us science and math, but Mama she likes to work, and um, so Mama works the night shift while the second wife takes care of us, and you know, when you call or when you. When you call, we can't answer because the second wife says we're busy, so we can't talk to you right now. And when you you can't really come by and pick us up because the wives and the the the, the husband says he doesn't want another man just to pop up in their lives. And it's like y'all gonna get y'all selves killed. I mean, you gonna get fucking shot like this because this is a part of the 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 equation that people don't want to talk about. You know, it's. It's not a good look. Um, and that's that's a problem. That's a major, major problem. Also with that problem, because of how society works, um, family courts, divorce, alimony, child support, because you can't, in, in the legality of you can't have multiple wives, so these, this is just basically uh, a bunch of girlfriends in the house, a bunch of women in the house, you know, because marriage is a business in America, so the legal contract, you can't have three, four wives, two, three, four wives, it's not, you know, that's a crime, basically, so the loophole in that is, you could actually have two, three, four women, and a couple of them be divorced, and a couple of them have children by somebody else, and they can be collecting alimony and child support from their ex, and actually bringing it into the collective household of a polygamous relationship, and, and you have these guys' resources taking care of a polygamous relationship, but they are not necessarily welcome to come by. That's going to create some animosity. Because, which refers back, to, that's why I say some of these guys look dusty as shit. Because some of these, these guys just look like dusty, dirty Mac and ass players. And you got to ask yourself, who's living off of other men by saying that they're the man of the house? Like, who's living off of, okay, I'm working as a guy, all the women are working in some capacity, and a couple of the women have extra income from divorce alimony settlements or, or and child support but we're working collectively as a unit but make sure you don't bring another man in my house but his money is all over my damn house not gonna work b like not gonna work because because um it, it causes too much dissension and that also causes relationship problems um with parenting because if those two, if people can't work out as parents, I, and then all of a sudden, you could you could work out as an individual, but you can work out as an extra, and you can you couldn't parent as co-parents with one person, but you can parent with a couple with some other women and another dude. It, it's gonna that's a clusterfuck of, of of shit that's gonna happen, and your kids gonna turn on you on that. This is why I say, to, in my opinion, polygamy is not gonna work because. Um, 
everybody's not on the same page and everybody doesn't have the same intentions and every and a lot of this for the most part just has to do with deprived sexuality in my opinion you know you want consistent sex from somebody so you're willing to to um, add more women to the equation or, or a couple multiple women are willing to share one guy but you know I don't think young couples who are in their 20s are going to do this. I think couples who've been through bad relationships in their 30s and 40s and 50s are probably more likely to do this type of shit because nobody wants to share. It's my opinion. And but that's just my opinion. I'm done. Fuck it.